The Japanese government might have intentionally tried to stop the issue of wartime sexual slavery from gaining too much international attention back in the early 1990s. This is according to Japan's Asai Shimbun. The Daily unveiled a diplomatic document dating from 1993 which shows the Japanese government, citing testimony hearings that were going on in Korea at that time, had ordered their embassies in Southeast Asia to avoid conducting any fact-finding investigations or research into the matter. The Daily says Tokyo tried to handle the matter quickly and contain the issue by dealing with other countries separately from Korea in the face of mounting criticism at that time.